Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install any Canon printer in Windows 10 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. So let's go to our video. First, we check our machine is 32 bit or 64 bit. That is very easy. Go to there. Here we find this PC. Right click on this PC. Here we find properties. Click on the properties. In properties, go to the system type. If system type is 32 bit, then that machine is 32 bit operating system machine. If system type is 64 bit, then that machine is 64 bit operating system machine. This machine is 64 bit operating system. Close it. After that, go to the any web browser that you like. I am going to the Google Chrome. There is two ways to download our printer from the internet. I go to the first way first and then second. First way is go to the here in search type cannot printer then our printer model number type cannot printer printer model number and driver and hit enter key on our keyboard first link is from the canon but it is only 64 bit go to the second link support then our printer name support and our printer name open the our second links here we find our second link here we find our model number here we find drivers and here we find our operating system and here is the our drivers and this is the our second first way our second way is also very simple go to the here and remove this model number remove this model number remove our model number and type canon printer driver and hit enter key on our keyboard first link is the form driver software and firmware open that link first link open the first link and here we find two options first option is keywords and second is the byproduct first we see the from the our Keywords here we find our operating system. Select your operating system Windows 10, 64 bit, Windows 10, 32 bit, or any other operating system. Here we find types, type the uh, software, driver, or firmware. Select what you want, and here type the your keyword or the printer number and go to the search. But it's showing me lots of results. So I go to the second way. Second way is by product. Go to the by product, click on product. Here do not type anything i'm not going to the type anything i go to the here and add type my printer model number lbp my printer model number is 3300 and here go to the search not click at here go to the search it directly go to the our site go to the here search and here we find model numbers or models found and click on the your model lbp 330 in my case here we find same website here we find our model number. Here we find driver software and firmware. Here is the, our driver. Here we find our operating system. If it's not to take your operating system right and the bit right, then go to the here. If take Windows 10 32 bit, then go to the Windows 10 plane. If Windows 10 64 bit, then go to the 64 bit. Select the, your operating system and OS right. Click on the here English and click on the search and it show a driver. If you want to software, then go to the software. I want only driver, so I click on the driver and it's redirect you to the another page click on the download and our download is started in few seconds depending on the your model number and driver size it's take time so be a patient in my case it's not take a long time click at here downloads show in a folder our download is completed click on show in a folder minimize the our website and drag this file to set desktop close it here we find our setup file there are many ways to install it but simple way is the by basic way we are going to that way right click on it and click on extract basically this file is gif file we are going to unzip it click on extract files click on the ok and here we find our drivers double click on it in this in this folder we find our drivers in some cases or in 99 percent it is in drivers here is the our drivers in some cases it is in other folder but in 99 it is in drivers folder here we find two ways or the three ways to install this file first way is go to the here set a file double click on it and install it second way is click on here in this unzip folder and double click on the setup and install it but third way is very simple and the very reliable way and i will show you that way close it go to the start and type printers and scanners and click on the printers and scanners in printers and scanners Go to the add a printer or scanner. Click on the add a printer or scanners. Here it's refresh and one new option is pop up at this point. New option is the printer that I want isn't listed. Click on that printer that I want isn't listed. Minimize it. 
here we find add a printer in add a printer we find many option go to the last option add a local printer or network printer with manual setting last option click on the next here we find port port is the most imp part in this installation go to the here and here select usb port select any usb port that you find usb 001 002 003 004 select any usb click on the next have a dicks go to the browse go to the desktop go to your folder and here find your drivers file double click on the drivers mis or any other folder and find your drivers in this case my drivers are in the driver folder double click on it and here we find something like this file select that file select this file and it is an dot inf file select dot inf file and click on the open click on the ok here you find our printer name. If you find many printers, select your printer and printer model number and select your printer or printer serial number. Or if your printer is in series, then find the your printer series. Click on that and click on the next. Add your printer name, any name that you want. You can add any name at this point. Click on the next. It is installing our printer depending on the, your model number and driver size. It take some time or the long time. Here we find some options our printer is now installed if you want to share this printer on network select this if you don't want to share this printer on network then click on do not share this printer click on the next if you want to print a test page then click on a printer test page or click on the finish after that go to the start and go to the power button and restart your machine restart your machine is imp after machine is restart check our printer is properly installed or not go to the start type printers and scanners Click on the printers and scanners. If you find your printer at this point, that means your printer is properly installed and it's working 110% on your Windows 10 PC or laptop. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.